consider how my light is spent ere half my days in this dark world and wide, and that one talent which is death to hide, lodged with me, useless, though my soul more bent to serve therewith my maker, and present my true account, least he returning chide. Doth God exact day labor, light denied, I fondly ask? But patience to prevent that murmur soon replies, God doth not need either man's work or his own gifts. Who best bear his mild yoke, they serve him best. His state is kingly. Thousands at his bidding speed and post o'er land and ocean without rest. They also serve, who only stand and wait. fond lover prithee why so pale will when looking well can't move her looking ill prevail prithee why so pale why so dull and mute young sinner prithee why so mute will when speaking well can't win her saying nothing do it prithee why so mute quit quit for shame this will not move this cannot take her if of herself she will not love, nothing can make her, <laughs> the devil take her. The spacious firmament on high, with all the blue ethereal sky, and spangle heavens a shining frame, their great original proclaim. The unwearied sun from day to day does his creator's power display and publishes to every lamb the work of an almighty hand. Soon as the evening shades prevail, the moon takes up the wondrous tale and nightly to the listening earth repeats the story of her birth. Whilst all the stars that round her burn and all the planets in their turn Confirm the tidings as they roll, and spread the truth from pole to pole. What though in solemn silence all move round this dark terrestrial ball? What though no real voice nor sound amidst their radiant orbs be found? In reason's ear they all rejoice, and utter forth a glorious voice, forever singing as they shine, the hand that made us is divine. Piping down the valleys wild, piping songs of pleasant glee, on a cloud I saw a child, and he laughing said to me, pipe a song about a lamb. So I piped with merry cheer, piper, pipe that song again. So I piped, he wept to hear. Drop thy pipe, thy happy pipe. Sing thy songs of happy cheer. So I sung the same again, while he wept with joy to hear. Piper, sit thee down and write in a book that all may read. So he vanished from my sight, and I plucked a hollow reed. And I made a rural pen, and I stained the water clear. And I wrote my happy songs, every child may joy to hear. Tiger, tiger, burning bright In the forests of the night What immortal hand or eye Could frame thy fearful symmetry? In what distant deeps or skies Burn the fire of thine eyes? On what wings dare he aspire? What the hand dare seize the fire? And what shoulder and what art could twist the sinews of thine heart? And when thy heart began to beat, what dread hand and what dread feet? What the hammer, what the chain? In what furnace was thy brain? What the anvil, what dread grasp dare its deadly terrors clasp? When the stars threw down their spears and watered heaven with their tears, did he smile his work to see? Did he who made the lamb 
make thee. Tiger, tiger, burning bright in the forests of the night, what immortal hand or eye dare frame thy fearful symmetry?